In today's video, I am going to take a couple of my decor pieces that I already have and I'm going to redo them, revamp them. And one of them is this wreath. I made this wreath for a DIY, oh, I don't know, a couple years ago. And I still like it, I still think it's pretty, but I have come to discover that I really don't decorate with pink. And if I were to use this wreath, it would be as an um, on the outside of my front door in the springtime. Well, I really want to use this wreath inside my house, but pink does not go with my everyday decor. So I'm going to change it up. I'm going to make a different bow. I'm going to take all the pink flowers off and I'm going to redo that. The other item that I'm going to work on is this birdhouse. I got this birdhouse, I don't even know, so many years ago from Home Interiors. I believe it came from Home Interiors. And again, I love it, but I haven't used it in my decor much because of the pink. So I'm going to change this up and make it so it fits my decor better. So let's go ahead and get started. The way I have the tripod set up, the way I found that's best to set it up, is that you guys will be watching it from, like from a side angle um, and hopefully that works out well. First thing I'm going to do with this is deconstruct it and take all of the pink off. Now it's time to put in the new uh, color scheme, which is going to be yellow and greens, greens and yellows, maybe a little bit of white. And I'm going to attach them with zip ties.
So I made this bow off camera. I am not a very good bow maker, so I didn't want to do any kind of a tutorial on it. I just kind of winged it. <laughs> but it turned out cute and I will do some more fluffing. Uh, I still need to add more in here by the bow. The other bow that I took off was bigger. So I want to cover up all of these um, bare spaces. I'm going to use some of this and I'm going to just stick them in there and I probably, I will use a combination of hot glue and uh, zip ties to get all of these little uh, picks in there and I'm going to cut these apart as I always do. It just makes it so much easier to work with when you cut them apart. half door that goes leads down to my basement and I really like it. I think it turned out very nice. It's subtle and kind of a warm and homey look to it and I really like it. I did like the pink but I like this as well and probably not actually I probably liked the pink a bit more but it just didn't just didn't suit my uh, decor and I couldn't really find a good place for it so I think I'm gonna get a lot more use out of this wreath done in the more neutral tones. So with the birdhouse again I am going to take off all of the pink. Some of this pink stuff I added to it over the years. Um, the bird the bird nest came with it, and so did the eggs and the apples and the um, roses. I'm not sure. I think what I'm probably gonna have to do is just take my wire cutters and snip off all of the pink stuff. It's the only way I'm gonna be able to redo this.
And here is where I put the birdhouse in my bathroom on my bathroom sink. And I really, really like it. I think between the two projects, I think the, the wreath turned out pretty, but it didn't really improve it. Like I, li I really did like the pink. It just didn't fit with my decor. That's why I changed it. It didn't make it worse, but it didn't really make it any better. I, but it did, did change it, and I, I like the way it looks. As far as the birdhouse goes, I think I have improved it greatly by taking all the pink stuff off, taking all of the um, old things that I had stuck in there out, and freshening up it up with the lemons and the uh, baby's breath and everything. It looks so much, so cute. So, so, so cute. I do want to get a fake bird and glue it up here at some point. I don't have one in my stash, so that will have to happen at a later date. All right, friends, I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you have um, gotten inspiration that you can take some of your old decor, take stuff that's in your stash and just change it or spend a few dollars at Walmart for some new new foliage and flowers and change it up that way. You don't have to run out and buy something new every time you change your decor or your seasons or your style changes or whatever. Um, I really love this birdhouse. I didn't want to get rid of it, but I hardly ever used it in my decor anymore because like I said, the pink just did not go. Uh, years ago, years and years ago, I decorated my home in like the Victorian and that's when the pinks and the light greens and stuff like that really, you know, fit in with my decor. But I don't do that anymore. I don't do Victorian. I do vintage and country. And so I made this birdhouse into a vintage country rather than a Victorian style birdhouse. All right, friends, if you've enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section below, and we'll talk to you all later. Bye-bye, friends.